boys and girls. I know you've been working hard on our three letters, but we're going to keep practicing them because pretty soon we'll be moving on. Here we go. I'm going to say it first. Where is the baby Echo? It's hard for me to make it happen. And then you say it. Ready? Be bat ba. Say it with Echo. Ooh, dear me. And hold on. Ready? My turn. F fun. T top t. Very good. Boys and girls, we are going to try writing these. And to write them, it's a little silly. We're not going to use a pencil or anything. We're going to stand up. And we're going to write them like this with our hand extended. We're going to imagine. We're going to imagine. You ready? If we were looking at our wall, so you're facing a wall that's very far away, and you are going to imagine where the skyline is. So ready? Take your hand and see how I'm using two fingers? Point to the skyline. The imaginary skyline. Where would it be? It would be near the top. Then I want you to think about the plane line. So take your arm and bring it down to the plane line. Under the plane line is the grass line. So take your hand at the plane line and point to the grass line. And then we have the worm line. And that goes right down to the bottom. So let's try it one more time. Ready? Point to the skyline. Point to the plane line. Point to the grass line. And point to the worm line. Now, did you see how my arm is not bent? Okay, I'm going to rest my arm. You ready? And we're going to try our first letter. Okay? And we are all going to repeat after me. When we make the lowercase b, we say, b is a skyline letter. You say, b is a skyline letter. Point to the skyline. Pull down to the grass line. Trace up and around on the grass. Trace up and around on the grass. Ready? B, bat, ba. Ready? Next one. Repeat after me or echo. F is a skyline letter. Point to the skyline. Go across the skyline and down to the grass. Oops, sorry, let me do it again. Go across the skyline and down to the grass. Across the skyline, down to the grass. Cross on the plane line. Cross on the plane line. Ready? F, fun, f. Your turn. F. One more. Ready? T is a skyline letter. Oops, where'd it go go? Come back. <laughs> Ready? T is a skyline letter. T is a skyline letter. Point to the skyline. You say it. Yep, point to the skyline. Pull down to the grass line. Pull down to the grass line. Cross on the plane line. T, top, T. Beautiful. Okay, so I told you I had something a little special for you today. Well, this is our book. I hope you're keeping your books in a very special place. I love having a collection of books that I can read. Isn't it great to be able to read them all by yourself? So it says, we like fall. Hmm. Remember I told you there was something special in your bag? Well, don't go get it now. When we're done, if you don't have it, you can go and get it. This is what you will find in your bag. Something that will make pointing to the words a little bit more fun. 
So if you are a boy, you are going to find this kind of a monster finger that will be very fun to point with. If you are a girl, you will be finding a glittery monster finger. Everybody just gets one. And these are for reading helpers. At the end of the month, don't worry, they're gonna be yours to keep. You don't have to give them back. They're a little present. But for right now, it's to help us remember about pointing when we read. So when you read this book, we like fall. The finger will help me to know what words you're looking at. Read it with me now. We like, that's one of our sight words. We like the leaves. Oh, do you see the again? Ready to point, you start this way. We like the apples. We like the sc scarecrow. <laughs> and we like fall. Very good. Well, today I'm going to have a little job for you. Not only do I want you to read your book to me, and maybe mom or dad could take a video, because I want to see you touching those words, but... When you're doing your words today, I want you to remember how we do our very best. If you want to color your book, color the parts that you are going to take your time on, okay? I only want your best coloring. And then here's the challenge. I love a good challenge. Remember this word? You can say the or you can say the but it's always spelled T-H-E. Hmm, so in your book, we're gonna look for the word the. T-H-E, is it on the cover? It's not, so I'm gonna go to the next page. Ready? Oh, no, it's hard to see, sorry guys. It says, we like the leaves. I see it, the, with your pencil, circle the word, the. Do not scribble on it. We like the leaves. Can you find it on this one? Ready? You look for the. Ready? We like the pumpkins. I'm going to circle it carefully. See? The pumpkins. And we like the apples. We're only circling the, circling the word the or the. We like the scarecrows. T-H-E. And let's see if it's on the last page. We, oops, we like fall. Not there. Well, ready? One more time. Can you say the, oh, sorry, Eagle Eye. Can you say the poem with me? You can say the, or you can say the, but it's always spelled T-H-E. See if you can find that word for me, boys and girls. It's a sight word. It's one we remember. Enjoy your reading and find a special place for those books. See you later.